Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a what's in my Ipsy bag and it's basically going to be like an unwrapping kind of haul type thing. So I've been subscribed to Ipsy since January and I've never done a unwrapping haul type thing and I know they're kind of popular around here YouTube. I know a lot of gurus do them and they get uploaded to Ipsy. Um, I'm not affiliated with Ipsy by any kind of form or anything. They probably don't even know who the heck I am. So um... I don't know, I just wanted to do one like that because I think it's cool. It's cool to be surprised on camera to see your reactions and stuff. Um, and I know there's some things that I do like when I get in my Ipsy bags and there's sometimes things that I don't like. I mean, it's $10 and you do get a good amount of products and stuff like that. But um, yeah, so let's get started with um, the video. So here is a bag on the opposite side. All my address information's on there, so I won't um, show you that part of it. I'm going to show you where the seal is. Um, it's pretty easy to open. It's just with adhesive. You can just open it. So this is what's in the bag. Um, you see you get the little makeup bag, and then you get some kind of um, paper thing here. And that's it. Nothing else in there. So let's see. So this is just a little Ipsy card that you usually get. I mean, it just says, um, if, take a photo of your glam bag goodies, share with Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and then just tag people. And then it has just the different types of people who are, um, you know, who sponsor it or whatever, who gives kind of like us products or something like that. I don't know. Um, but yeah, so this is this month's little bag. I do like the color of the baggie. Um, it's like a kind of like a midnight blue type thing. It's um, real. What is it? Beauty rocks. Um, it's. I like the theme of it. It's like a um, record type thing. Um, I think it's super cute. So yeah. So let's open and see what's on. What's in there? So you start off and you see like there's a lot of product in here. I'm excited to see what I get. I'm not gonna pull this out in any kind of order. Um, obviously it's the first time I'm opening it, so I'm just gonna start pulling out and stuff. So this first thing I get here. This is the Dr. Brandt, Dr. Brandt's Microdermabrasion Skin Exfoliate. It says, um, for all skin types, and the direction, oh, Dr. Brandt recommends dampen skin with warm water, um, slowly and gently massage cream onto skin for one to two minutes, avoiding the eye area. Rinse well, pat dry, best of use once to two times a week. I am so for trying new products and stuff. Usually when it's time for my menstrual cycle to come during, um, time of the month, um, I usually always get, like, a, um, blemish right here on my chin. It's, you know, it's funny that, um, this is totally off subject. I used to always get, like, a blemish, like, on kind of, like, my thigh area every single time menstrual, my menstrual, like, period was gonna come. But, um, uh, now it just kind of changed location. Now it's right here. The good, the good old spot, the chin, right? Um, but yeah, so I'm all for trying new skincare products. I think skincare products are awesome. Um, so I'm excited to try this out. And this is just the Dr. Brandt Microdermabrasion Skin Exfoliate, whatever. Okay, so next we have here, this is the Urban Decay 24-7 Velvet Glide-On Eye Pencil. Now, I, um love the glide on pencils and what is this? on the back it says have an obscene addiction to black liner like we do check out other black pencil shades zero and perversion i've tried both of those i love perversion i used to well i do love it now and i think i still have a lot in my um, makeup um setup back there um i have a lot of those eyeliners and i love them i love perversion now let's see let's open it up Oh wow, this is a really nice sized um, pencil. And this is just, it's, just, it's a really good size. Look at that. So this is my hand. And let's put it to the top. So look at that. That's a pretty good size um, pencil. Well, I guess that really doesn't count because people have different kind of size hands. Okay, this is my iPhone 5. So this is how, this doesn't help at all. Okay, there we go. So look, it's kind of about the size of the iPhone 5, kind of a little, a little bit shorter, um, but wow, this is a really good size um, pencil. I'm excited to try this. I didn't know that they had this color, black velvet. I honestly thought Zero and um, Perversion were the only colors Urban Decay had. So, let's see. 
Oh, that goes on so smoothly and it's extremely pigmented as you can tell. Um, I'm excited to try this out to see how it works on a waterline. Alright, so the next item we have here, this is really cute. City of Color White Gold. What is it? White Gold Mousse Eyeshadow. So I like the little container of it. It's really cute. It's a little um, heart and everything. It's super cute. Um, let's open this puppy up. So I have it open and everything. I like the cute little container. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. And I love it. It's so chic and it just has a simple little pink heart on it. Let's see. So this is so this little top comes off of it like that. So I'm just gonna grab it from what's on the little plastic container itself. Ooh, this is really pigmented. Oh, I like the color. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, oh my god, that is awesome. This is going to be such an awesome color for the spring and summertime. It's like white, like it's literally white gold. Like literally the name describes what it is. It looks, doesn't look so shimmery on my camera, on my MacBook obviously, but kind of when you move it up like this, you can totally see the color specs, like the goldish color. Oh my god, this is going to look so awesome for like spring and summer and just like, oh, I can't wait to use this. And it, oh my god, it's a, it's a lot of product in here. Wow. Ugh, this is awesome. I've never heard of this brand. What brand is it? The City Color. I've never heard of that brand. But um, now I have all this over, so. Now, I think this would be also cool as like kind of like a highlight maybe possibly. I'm not too sure. Oh, wow. This must... This is really smudge resistant. Wow, this is a lot of pigment. So I'm definitely excited to try this puppy out for spring and summer. I think it's going to be awesome. Can't wait to do some tutorials with this. I think it's going to be super cool. Alrighty, so the next item here, we have a tinted lip balm. This is an apple pink. and This is by Kaylin or Kylan, something like that. Um, this is the brand. I've, I've had this brand come um, in other Ipsy bags before. Um, so, yeah. This is a really big container. Oh. <laughs> That's why it comes with a little brush. Okay. So, the little lip brush is actually on top. So, you get the lip brush and then you get the lip balm. So, the lip brush is pretty cool. Oh, it's a pretty good size. Yeah, I think it's going to be cool awesome to apply that on there so okay so this is an awesome nude color you guys this is gonna be like an awesome nude color for me I think it's gonna be awesome because usually colors like mauvey kind of pinky orangey type colors are awesome for nudes for me um, like the one I'm wearing right now um, hmm, I'm excited to try this out so hopefully, oh yeah, that's going to look awesome on my lips. I'm excited to try that out. I'm getting really good products this month. Awesome. Okay, so this is, again, um, Kaylin's Tinted Lip Balm in Apple Pink. Alright, so we have one more thing in here. And this is the Big Sexy Hair Root Pump Volumizing Spray Mousse. So I actually... I think I have this in like the big O size, but this is gonna be awesome to take when I go to the like the beach or on vacation and stuff. I know I'm going to a work convention in San Antonio um, two or three weeks from now. I think it's two weeks from now, and um, this is gonna be come in handy to take in my bag just so that I don't have to like carry a lot of things, like a big bulky stuff. So well, guys, that is it for what's in my Ipsy bag. Nothing else is in here. Um, 
this was super fun to open in front of you guys I think it's pretty cool uh, let me know in the comments below if you would like to see more of these like kind of like op and opening things um I did order stuff from the VIB sale from Sephora I should be getting that stuff in on Thursday so let you guys let me know if you would like to see an unboxing haul for Sephora and stuff like that um my sister's getting married in two weeks and I'm gonna do my own hair and makeup and um kind of ordered some stuff like foundations and kind of other things just to um try out as well um I'll be doing some reviews on some of those guys and um yeah um I'm sorry I think I tell you guys these things like every time I film a video that um I am trying to get a camera soon um money has been a little tight um for these past few weeks and stuff just because stuff with my sister's wedding and then just stuff that I need to purchase for myself like school stuff and just all kinds of other crazy stuff that's been going on and stuff. So, um, I'm tr um, trying to save up and uh, probably my next check or two will probably go towards my camera. Like, um, if I'm going to buy a camera, I think I'm going to buy, like, a really good camera. I'm thinking of buying, like, the Canon EOS T3i. So, let me go know what kind of other videos you would like to see. Um, but yeah, guys, I will see you in my next video. Bye!